hello friend so in this video i am going to show you you can see in last video i show you this example how you can make this on your own way now i am going to show you how you can add image with this all the details so first of all here you can see this uh, we have this table so we need to add one more field so after contact i am going to add one more field image one I am going to take here wear care and here 500. So we have this field now, and here we need to add one file upload control. So, first of all, in form tag, you need to write enc type. multi part form data then and then you can upload image otherwise you can't that's why you need to do that now just copy this paste this image here we are going to take input type file oh no worry we did this inside edit but no problem just copy this and we need to add index inside index here yeah and from edit we need to copy these things and we need to paste here also Here I am going to change name F1. So in edit also I am going to change the name F1. Yeah. Now in index. Let's see. You can see. We got here this button. File upload control. Here. in bottom 20 pixel no no it's okay no problem okay so now when we press this insert button here we need to write code to upload image so first of all you can see we need to create one folder inside our php connection folder so i am going to open this folder inside this folder yeah i am going to create one folder name images so we are going to upload image on that so first of all dollar fnm is equal to underscore files f1 is a control name and then name so we are going to get the name then dollar dst means where we are going to upload this file dot slash, dot slash it means path up to this php underscore connection inside we have folder name images and dollar fnm this is the same name we are going to take same path but variable different i will explain you why now move uploaded files dollar underscore files f1 tmp underscore name and dollar dst you can see we take here two variable one is dollar dst one is dollar dst1 the difference is only in dst1 i did not pass this i remove this and in dst i, I pass this because dst for our path means source to destination this is our source path here we need to give two parameter from where we are going to copy this image and from where we are going to set this is the source and this is the destination for destination we set this dot class and this dollar dst1 we are going to save inside our table 
so in table we don't need dot, dot slash that's why we take two variable yeah now here i am going to take one variable to make our image name unique that's why yeah now i'm going to show you first of all i'm going to delete this record yeah now we are going to check this is working or not i'm going to select image yeah i select one image and insert so first of all here don't worry because here we need to pass one more parameter it is remain that's why but we got inside this folder or not yeah we got this now we are going to check inside the table yeah we got image also so now here we are going to display that before first name so image copy paste here i am going to write img src i am going to write height 100 width 100 and here we need to pass echo dollar row and our field name image one let me check field name yeah image one that's fine so here you can see we got that image so this way we can get image over here now i am going to show you how we can edit image so in edit operation edit.php we already said that but here we are going to display that image first so in edit.php here dollar image one dollar row image one here i'm going to take img src then height v100 and here we are going to display the path so echo ruler image one yeah so now here you can see we got this image but now when you select this image from here we need to update that image so i am going to show you how we can do that So first of all from index I am going to copy this code in edit I just paste this and now here we need to write condition like if user don't want to sometime user select the image sometime user don't select image so if user don't select image we don't need to fire update query if user select image then we need to fire update query so dollar fnm is equal to null either else null it means user did not select image so we need to fire update query but we don't need to update image so just keep like this otherwise in else just cut all paste here and here we need to write image one is equal to dollar dst one now we are going to check here this is working fine or not i am going to select this image update yeah and here you can see image is updated so this way we can update edit delete images from here a delete will work proper we don't need to do anything you can see just press delete because it is worth using id that's why Thank you so much for watching my video. If you like my video, then please like it and share it maximum. So, 
maximum people can get the job and thread the interest. Thank you so much for watching my video.